good morning it's saturday no it's sunday oh my god <laughs> i will never get my days right i don't think It's Sunday. Uh, yesterday I did the usual. I went to class and then I came home. I worked on a couple of things here and then I went back to the studio around seven o'clock and stayed until like midnight, <laughs> just training and trying to figure out the rest of some of this choreo and getting this combo down and all that jazz. But uh, I did it. I finally got this combo down. It doesn't look pretty, but I got it down, so that's the first step. So I've got two weeks, two weeks to uh, get it down and make it look good. We'll see. But I'm taking my coffee to go right now because I've got to run over to the studio. We're doing like a staff photo shoot thing, and then I'm gonna go to Denver to do some rehearsals, and then back to the studio to do another rehearsals. But I'm gonna take you along with me in this second week of October. It's too hot to Oh god. And it's really dark. Bye Amber! Good morning, uh, it's Monday. I'm gonna head to the studio before all the classes today. It's so nice out, so, well, there's construction, but it's really nice out, so I might just hang out outside for a little bit, go say hi to the land guardians and whatnot, and the tree spirits. But I'm gonna go to the studio and train a little bit for my showcase, and maybe I'll figure out a new thing that I'm teaching this week, I don't know. We'll see, but I'm gonna make tea first. currently reading a bunch of the comments from last week's vlog and it's not in focus again from last week's vlog it's literally been nothing but kind and supportive comments even those people who are like you know I, I really do just follow you for witchy stuff and even then like I appreciate this and then people saying that this is like one of my best vlogs ever and <laughs> like the storytelling is really good that just makes me so happy like that's Something I was, I've, I'm like trying to focus on of keeping it, you know, down to earth, but, and not so cinematic that it's like, I mean, you know, Peter McKinnon, I could totally, I could totally try to get to his level of vlogs one day, but I usually freak out when I'm trying to read the comments. They usually freak me out to read, uh, cause they can ruin my day. They can ruin my week, you know, especially after you put a lot of work into something that you really, really care about and then you put it on the internet and then, you know, sometimes people say really mean things and you're like, oh wow, that felt like shit. There you are. Okay, Carly, I see you. It says, <laughs> I'm gonna call you out. I actually took a beginner, a couple of beginner classes at Rockstar recently, but I was too nervous to take your class. I've been watching you for almost three years and I didn't want to embarrass myself fangirling. <laughs> 
But now that I know that you're at Rockstar, you better take a class with me. It's really funny because one of my other students, Juniper, hi Juniper, ha is actually in the showcase with me. Uh, Juniper is one of my chair people. I'm really excited to show you that at the end of this month once we get videos and stuff. But Juniper told me that they started watching me on YouTube and, and for about three months I guess they took classes that weren't mine, like completely avoided my classes because they were intimidated and I, I like meeting you. I like meeting all of you. So if you ever work up to it, you know, come take a class with me. I would love that. One person said, I mean, it's, it was a long ass vlog and I'm sure this one will be long too. But one person said, you know, a 30 minute vlog usually wouldn't be one of my things, but with me, they don't have any problem. And that's, that means a lot as a creator. I want to make sure that it's something worth watching. Yeah, thank you. I really, I really do appreciate you. Just watching my videos, you, you know, like just putting them on in the background while you clean or something. Y'all are, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway, I gotta go to the studio. I decided, focus. I decided that I didn't like last week's choreo that much. So, as if I didn't have enough work to do, I'm making a new one to teach tomorrow. <laughs> again. Again, 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 and again. morning it's Tuesday and I'm still not in fucking focus there we go so I definitely ended up staying up a lot later than expected last night working on the video with Frankie he slept in a little bit today so I feel a little rested however everything hurts I am so sore I am finishing putting up everything for the video with Frankie I'm finishing the description and the thumbnail and putting it for my patreons and captions and all that jazz and then today I have a couple of like witchy chores I need to do. They're just like little things, but I need to kind of get through and get those done before I have class tonight because we also have a rehearsal for the showcase coming up. We are doing three more rehearsals and then it's the show. I'm really, really, really excited for this, this group number. It looks amazing already and I'm just so excited. Anyway, enough of talking head. Let's get through our Tuesday.
up my mail today we got a lot of boxes on my channel long enough you know that this is one of my favorites so anyway let's open some boxes I know that one of them is the witch's box so that's exciting the other one is Anna Luisa and one is uh, from Ohio Botanica which is one of my favorite soap makers and wiser so I've got books for sure I have some witchy items from the witch's box some jewelry from Anna Luisa and some soap. Uh, let's see. She included a little wick candle that she made. Ooh, it smells like rose. Okay, so this is one of the soaps. This one's the Cafe Pumpkin. She does a lot of like seasonal soaps. They're super cool. She puts a lot of work into them and they're absolutely gorgeous. She also just has this really, really pretty Instagram feed. Okay, and then I ordered a candle. Cozy Chai Spice Vanilla. Oh my god, it smells like Christmas. And it's got one of the wood wicks. So it has that like fire popping sound. Alright, awesome. Like I said, it'll be linked down below. Oh, these are dangly. Dangly earrings. Those are pretty. Ooh, I'm gonna be wearing these with like some fancy December outfit, I think. And these are pretty, or like a New Year's. Aw, oh, these are pretty. Okay, okay, so Annalisa, always gorgeous pieces. Let's see what Wiser sent us. So Wiser isn't a sponsor of mine. They don't pay me to make reviews, but they do send me things to review things sometimes. So if, they have something that they want me to review or that they think that I might like, they'll send it to me um, and if I feel like I should make a review on it, I usually do. Oh, they sent me two things. Two? What? These are not books. Oh, ooh. okay, so the Relative Tarot is the first one. That's pretty cool. We're gonna have to go through that. And then, oh, the Wanderer's Tarot. This one I've actually seen before um, in a couple of shops and stuff, but sweet. Well, now my Patreons will have some new decks to finally look at during their readings. And also it'll be a really interesting little, you know, I should do like a live, uh, like pull a card or something on Instagram. I don't do those very often. They tend to drain me pretty quick, but on a day that I'm feeling good, then maybe I can do that. Okay, and lastly, the witch's box for October. Unboxing, because that'll be fun. Why not? Why not? Yeah, okay, well that was our mail. Okay, so something really quick. I was going through the Relative Tarot, and first of all, it's really, it's an interesting deck. It's gorgeous. Um, it reminds me of like an antique store, so, if you like look at the look at the design it also has gilded edges which just speak to my soul it contains three different kinds of lovers cards right there's the original one with the man and the woman then there is two men and there's two women 
And I think that's pretty cool. Alright, I just got back from teaching my level one class in the mornings. Uh, man, I, oh, forgive the noise, I'm making tea. <laughs> it's so fulfilling to watch somebody work on something that was originally challenging for them or something new and them kind of working through that challenge and then getting it and then finally having it click. It's just fulfilling. I just, I love my job. I love it, I love it, I love it. It's, <laughs> it's the best job in the world. Anyway, we stayed at rehearsal pretty late last night because the Sin City Showcase is next Friday. Um, we only have two more rehearsals for the group before the actual showcase. So I'm trying to really get everything into place. I'm trying to get everybody on their beats. I'm trying to get everybody on their mark. And they look so good already. And um, I'm pumped. I'm just stoked. I'm so excited. I'm, I might cry because I, <laughs> I'm just really proud of everybody and I'm also proud of myself for putting this together. It was really hard uh, for the first group choreographed dance I've ever done. So that's cool. I should probably post something on Instagram saying that I will do a live reading for like an hour maybe. Maybe I should do the unboxing first since I have light. Well first I need a shower before anything else. I need a shower for sure. I think that's all. So good amount of stuff to do, but not, not anything crazy. So let's get started on that. Okay, I threw on some press on nails, but I threw these on for um, the unboxing that I'm hoping to do today and the live that I'm hoping to do today. And then tomorrow, I really hope that I can take most of it off. Maybe I'll, I'll edit a little bit, but otherwise I'm, I'm kind of hoping I don't have to leave my house other than to go to dinner with my dad because I'm really, really f***ing tired. Um, but after I do some of this work stuff, I'm going to head over to my friend Garrett's. Tyler is teaching all of us how to play Magic the Gathering, so that's always fun, and I get to click my nails and annoy the f out of all of them, so it's gonna be a good night. <laughs> I just didn't want it to be like silent while I just sat here by myself in my room on the floor, so. Yeah. Oh, it's midnight for you. <laughs> I don't go live very often. If you want a reading, I will pull one card and I try to make it quick. Hey, that- Hey, what you dude? Oh my god. It's my- Make sure you capture my good side. I will. Don't worry. Man, you didn't even ask me which side my good side was. <laughs> Is it your left side? No, I was gonna leave. Oh. <laughs> What did you get? You got a, a good Philly. Yeah. I don't know what a Philly. Oh, so okay, so then this is Philly, and then that's the avocado yeah. salmon. That looks really good. Holy yeah, shit. you can have some. I guess. <laughs> I, guess. I only have yes. one pair of chopsticks though. Hey, someone, they thought you were a badass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Garrett, if you give me a fork, I'm gonna throw it away okay, when I'm done with it. This for myself, asshole. Okay. <laughs> I kind of wanted to, but she made me feel like a peasant. <laughs> Good. So I'm not. I don't like. Good morning. It's Thursday, and Thursday means money magic. So I'm actually gonna film the money magic video today, and then I'm gonna try to edit. Actually, I'm gonna try to film the money magic video today and an unboxing video today because I put some nails on. <laughs> so I don't want to waste those because I really want to take them off right afterwards. Hopefully maybe edit that later tonight after I go to dinner with my dad. But otherwise that's all I'm doing and then I'm really really hoping that tomorrow I can kind of take tomorrow off because I didn't really spend all that much time last night with my friends because I was really tired and I'm also just, my body hurts from training so. Almost there. We're almost there. I 
just finished filming the money bowl money video. I feel really good about it. There's something, I'm, I'm like I said, I'm not like crazy about the witchy videos at the moment, but there's something about this video that I really think is gonna help a lot of people that I'm gonna set up for the unboxing. And then I, oh fuck, what time is it? Throw everything into the computer, and then maybe by that time it'll be dinner. A lot of filming today. Vaccine cartoons from the early 19th century show people getting vaccinated and then sprouting horns or puking a cow out of their mouth. You should go look these up, they're really funny. And not that dissimilar from the anti-vaccine rhetoric we hear today. Film the unboxing. That's some good stuff. Um, oh, maybe I shouldn't have showed you that. Maybe I won't show you that until it comes out. I don't know. I just need to put everything away, dump this SD card into the computer. I might edit until I have dinner with my dad. I'm getting a lot of tarot cards this month. I think maybe I'll be doing some tarot card lives. I don't know. Those are fun. I actually do enjoy those. I just have to make sure I have enough energy to do that. But let's clean up. Let's clean up. unboxing video they're so easy to edit they're always really they're like a, a good a good fan favorite um, and also an, an easy video to just kind of get out while I'm working on a, a little more elaborate video so that's always nice I just had an idea I was working my money bowl as you saw today Why don't I charge the Ana Luisa bracelets that I got they're gold I should charge those I should dress them in a little bit of money oil and I should charge them on my money altar thinking about this being a dance instructor and choreographing stuff and being an editor are very similar or <laughs> editing editing videos because you have to listen to the same shit a hundred thousand times over and over and over and over and over and over <laughs> until you get it right and at this point I just like if I'm working on something like that, like if I'm working on a choreo, I'm working on a video, I don't even realize it. Like I will listen to the same thing over and over and over and over again. Over. If I'm working on it, I don't even care. Like I'll do it 100,000 times if I have to. <laughs> so I think they kind of go hand in hand, just like a lot of repetition, uh, a lot of repetition. And also when I'm driving somewhere, I usually have the song playing on repeat over and over and over and over. So I'm going through the choreo in my head, I'm going through different ideas or different like possibilities of the choreo in my head. Um, if I'm like creating it or if I already have the choreo, I'm just going over it in my head. It satisfies those pieces of my type five brain just perfectly. <laughs> so I think that's why uh, it is so satisfying for me to do these things despite the fact that they're really fucking tedious. This literally took me 15 minutes. Like, on the camera, this is 15 minutes. <laughs> okay, I feel like I have to warm up again. God damn. There's a place I have never
can't land this. And it might just be today, because I did it last week, or like earlier this week. But I... <laughs> okay. One more time. One more time, one more time, one more time. Ooh, even if it's shitty, it's fine. Practice, any practice is good practice. <laughs> the holla now, we got it. Hey! Well, um, pressure's fine on it, which is, that's good news. Uh, I just can't bend it. So, yeah, I can put pressure on it just fine. I just can't bend it. So I'm gonna put away my stuff and head home, shower, and then just edit because. And it's frustrating. Honestly, it's such a minor inconvenience because I know what I know my knee is gonna be fine either tomorrow or you know in a day or two I'm just so frustrated I wasn't able to get that combo down again at least once today and then I injured myself so I couldn't continue to work on it and the show was so close too so I think it's a bit of that as well I just ended up uploading everything and getting all the tedious things done for the Money Bowl video. Playing a little bit of guitar while I waited for it to upload and all that, so I think I'm just gonna read and head to bed, but I'll get this combo down next week. So, wish me luck, and I'll see you then. Fingertips against my cheek Gold leaf across your lips Kiss me until I can speak Gold chain beneath your shirt The shirt that you let me wear 